Okay, so we're now at a friend's house. We just started the locomotive for the first time. Turn the gas up. And we'll wait until we've got some pressure. Well, we've got a, we've got a bit of pressure, as you can see. And I uh, don't know whether you can see, but the water level is right near the top. So we'll just let him, uh, we'll let the burner go until the safety goes off and then we'll adjust it and see if we can get this thing moving. Okay, the pressure is halfway on the gauge, so that should be 40 PSI, so the, the safety should be blowing off shortly. Okay, the safety valve is starting to go off now at 40. I just want to keep it going just to make sure that it really blows off. Yeah, it's blowing off now, so we'll turn the gas down and then see if we can get this thing going. Okay. Slowly but surely, needs to clear the cylinders. Okay, here we go, finally. Pressure stopped down, down very quickly, maybe it's just firing on one burner. But we'll check that in a minute. Okay, we'll stop it again. Check the important thing. Off we go. If we've got enough steam. Yep. There we go. We'll just do a couple of circuits, then we'll stop and uh, check everything. Okay, we'll stop it here and uh, have a check. Okay, we're going to try and uh, light it again. Okay, we've relit the locomotive and uh, it's already on the 40 psi and it's blowing off so that's the difference when both burners are actually on so we'll give it another go okay here we go
Okay, we're off for a second or third run, and it's working fine now. So what have we uh, come across? The rear left cylinder cover on the outside of the cylinder. That was leaking a bit, so we had to just tighten the four screws on the cylinder cover. And that's now fine. I put a bit more water in with the top up valve. What I'll do, I'll make another video about how you uh, use the locomotive another time. Uh, this one's, of course, just a quick test. Okay, if you look on the, the pressure gauge, you can see that the Pressure's down to zero, there's plenty of water in, so that means that the gas is empty and you can't hear the blows either, so not bad for a first test. We've taken out some of the little niggly problems, but it should be okay now. We'll do another run, but this time with the rolling stock behind and we'll have a bit of fun with it. So it was this cylinder cover that was leaking, so we had to just carefully just tighten these four retaining screws it's uh, it's sealed now that's fine okay we're steaming up for a second time this time with rolling stock behind it <laughs> 